So I was having troubles getting up early in the morning. And so uh, I decided to replace my rooster with, uh, with a duck. And now I wake up at the quack of dawn. Like that, that joke. Dominions has a very niche audience. Dominion 6, Rise of the Pentocrator, is a 4X strategy game. We're going to take a uh, uh, an empire of a fantasy faction and charge across the map. This is one of the most complex games that I have ever played. I've played Dominions 5 uh, quite a bit uh, on my channel before. I haven't, played, I haven't shown Dominion 6 off yet. Uh, this one comes out here today. And if you're into, like, games that don't necessarily look pretty, but play fantastic, then that's what Dominion 6 is. If you want to be a, uh, a faction of, of Roman centurions running across the map, you can do that. If you want to be a faction of, like, Aztec gods, there's those in there. There's merfolk and, and everything's in there. And the thing about this game is just, like, the depth of it. It kind of plays out like it looks simple. But there is just like layers and layers of, of depth in here. Anyway, let's. I'm going to stop yammering here. Let's just play the game. We're going to go with a small map today and we'll see what we can get into. There's lots of different varieties of worlds that we can create. If you're familiar with Dominions 5 or any of them ones before that, it's all pretty similar the way they play out. And I think most of the way these things develop is they kind of start out similar to, to the one before. This is similar to Dominions 5. But as the game comes out and as updates come out, it kind of begins to become its own thing. I think, I think that's kind of how the Dominion thing works. Ill Winters, the developer here. We have a uh, we have a, a, a top world. We also have an underworld as well, which will make a cave system down there. And there are some uh, like tribes that live down there. Um, if you haven't seen any of these games before, and you're familiar with something like Master of Magic, um, that's probably the closest thing to um, describing this. We'll call this live. Okay. So there is a um, uh, a plethora of depth and complexity. Complexity. Have I said that yet? There's three different ages of the game. If you start in the early ages, you're gonna have basically the Bronze Age. Magic is is prevalent and kind of wild. Middle Ages is a little more Iron Age stuff. You're gonna have new armors and better armors. Magic's a little more refined. Late Ages. Iron and steel are out there, so you've got proper armor. Bowmen don't do it quite as much because you've got big, sturdy armors on your units. Um, magics are stronger and uh, uh, more organized in their knowledge. There's different paths of magic, and each, each depending on who you pick here, is, is what tribes you have available to you. I'm gonna go with this. I'm gonna go with the Middle Ages just to play the game. And we'll see what we can get into. I will choose to be somebody. So we have the Old Kingdom. These are a bunch of hoplites and and uh, charioteers and elephant riders and, and and leaders. Anyway, we have the Old Kingdom. We've got the we got the giants. We've got the Ashen Empire, undead things. We've got the uh, Tower Man, sort of like the old, regular old uh, medieval units. We have the Golem Cult of these kind of folks. Civ with auto battler, yeah, yeah, kind of like a civilization, I suppose that works. Um, every unit has different stats, like protection, which which all factors into how uh, what kind of weapons need to, need to do damage to it. There's all these different factors are going into. Like if you got a guy with heavy armor, the little short bows aren't going to do anything to him. If you got a guy with um, with heavy armor, he's also going to walk a little slower, um, be more vulnerable to other things. There you go. Um, um, he may move slower. He's he's got some encumbrance on him. He may be able to swing as well because he's got a you know he's covered up in armor. You've got leaders and you've got units. The the grunts of the battlefield. Mostly we'll be making units, but we'll have a ca occasional commander to lead the thing. Hit a heavy guy, a guy with heavy armor with a fireball. Exactly. Um, what we're gonna do today is is we're gonna run in and we're gonna play as I saw these guys earlier. Hey, there's Satis. I played a big multiplayer thing last, I say last, last decade, <laughs> like six or five years ago, something like that, uh, of, with Satis. Hey, Talcazar, thank you very much. So I got, they got, I got, they got a, a warm spot in my heart. Something like that. Uh, these guys, what do you, what do you guys, I don't recognize you, the Wolf Clan Elite Warriors. Nice. Uh, we have Jotunheim, Giants, Goblins Riding on Moose, you know, those kinds. 
Um, we've got the Mictlon, which is kind of like... What do you guys... You're like the... Um, you're like the Aztec folk, I think, if I remember correctly. Um, Land of the Apes. Um, if you've seen, a, like, a Conquest of Elysium is is sort of like the, the, the quicker version of, of Dominions. Anyway, let's go play um, as Machaka, Reign of Sorcerers. That's who I want to be. So, the reason is because we have spiders. And we're at Old Sacral, Sacral Kingdom, where the well-being of the land is thought to be dependent on the will of the king. More spider folk. We have um, priests. Priests will cast magic, and uh, we use that magic to buff our troops. Our troops will then storm across the, the grounds as best we can. We've got spider riders, spider knights, black hunters. I want to show something here, if I can. Um, if we go back, so that was Middle Age Machaka. We go to Early Age Machaka. Where are they at here? We're the Lion Kings. And so there's this whole story with each faction and as they sort of like develop through the ages. So as at this stage, we're like, we have hyena clans and we have spider clan and we have lion clan and we can make lions. But the story kind of develops where I guess the spiders sort of take over. There you go, your lions first and the spiders start to gain control or whatever. Um, and units change a bit, of course. But with each one, you get a little bit of variety, depending on who you play at or what era you play in. Uh, anyway, we're going to play as Machaka. Reign of Sorcerers. We're going to play a bunch of random folks. Uh, do I say um, small map, random, we'll do random tunnels or uh, uh, caves, Middle Ages. Machaka. Fantastic music, by the way. It seems like a lot of tribes for a small map, but I'll take it. Okay, here we are. We're gonna we're gonna hire some spiders. We got spider warriors, Machaka warriors. Excellent. Let's begin. Okay, so now this is a game of of building a faction, a fantasy faction, right? We're spider people, but more importantly, we have a god, and we are the um, the pretender gods. What this game calls it, basically our our avatar of a god. We can be a very very powerful like stationary god, like a big hunk of stone sitting in the ground and, and kind of gives out his influence just by stationary things. We can go even bigger, but you get less, it, depending on how, what you choose here, it gives you less abilities and, and a different focus. Um, we, all the way down to just like a person, just some dude with a, with a hood walks around being a god. Um, we can be a big spider, so we're going to choose that one. So we're going to choose a spider as our god, and so we're going to go ahead and have him start the game here. So we're going to have this giant spider god in our faction to begin with, storming across the world. He has magic, and the type of magic that he has influences the kind of spells that my, my priests cast. So we're spider people, but if we wanted to, we could be, we could be spider people that raise the dead. Um, we could be spider people that, that, um, raise, uh, berserkers and, uh, healing things. Um, we can change the kind of magic that my, that my god gives to my casters. Um, I think blood is like, um, is, yeah, regen and stuff like that. So, yeah, yeah. Um, by default we start with, with a little bit of death, a little bit of glamour magic. Um, we got all we have 260 points to spend. We can put it into the kind of magic that we have, or we can put it into the dominion that we have. And this is going to affect the lands around us. So my, as I control this, I'm sort of terraforming the world as my god, my kingdom grows, so we can gain influence. We spend our points doing this to increase the income and the uh, uh, and the resources and all that that's happening in my in my lands, or the. Um, Productivity. You can see it that way. And we can also go the other way. We can go to Sloth, so things work, work bad. So as we control the land, it'll start getting boosted for us. Um, I think we'll go with a little bit of... We'll keep that at 2-1. It's probably fine. We'll do... We, uh, we like it hot. We're kind of a hot folk. And then I'm going to go and put in a little bit of... We'll do a little death magic. And let's add in... We can, we can command more undead units. I don't care this much about that. So blessed units will fight on even after they've been killed. They get blessed by the priests. Um, 
Living units that have died will die for real after the combat, but unit undead units will survive. So this is best if you have like an undead folk tribe. Um, let's try this. Let's let's do. Let's focus a little less on that. Let's put a point in here, and we'll just do heroism. Gain more experience. That's gonna be where I put. We'll put a, po a point into that. Let's try that. And then we'll do. Hmm. We can do one in there, maybe. Do I want undying? Do I want undying? So even if we die, we're still going to keep on fighting. We'll, we'll try it. We'll see what happens. Yeah. What's the worst that could happen? Uh, the candle is, is sort of the strength of my of my god being out there. And my and my um, uh, priests. Uh, no, no, no. My, uh, my um, folks that walk around spreading the news. Uh, let's do that. I got points to spend. There we go. That's probably good. We can choose to have my god be there now. We can have him show up in a year or show up in three years. He'll be there now. What is his name? His name is Spider Omtinti. Truly terrifying. All praise Omtinti. I should I should copy and paste. I could put that on my background. Hey, Antwerpia. All right, so we start with one, pro one province. Uh, there's some some independence out there in the world. Uh, to win the game, you can either conquer everything or you can win by thrones of ascension. There's these basically special places, control points. If you want to think of it that way, on the map, control the control points, you win the game. There's all the world. We're going to leave it as it is, and we'll just get into the game and play the game. Praise him, didn't he? Yeah, so this is a really, like, um, this is a really complex game. I think I said that before. Um, Conquest, if you like this kind of game, but you're like, man, that's just too much. Conquest of Elysium is the simplified version of this. And... Um, well, that, that's it. Period. Um, I played quite a bit of Conquest of, of Elysium. It even it takes place like in the same world, same empires, and everything. Just a much more simple, simpler version of it, but also a more scaled back version. Where this one, we're like conquering the world with gods and all that. It's a little bit less of that in Conquest of Elysium. That one, I suppose, is a little more more focused. Um, but anyway, we'll see if we can conquer the world with spider people. And see how this goes. There's different. You can be uh, like we're gonna be walking around on the land. We like a hot. There's also water people. There's cave people, and they're all gonna play very differently. And of course, you can make it even different, even more different, depending on what kind of god you choose, what kind of magic you choose. So here's a bit of our story. Out of chaos, the world uh, rose worlds populated by multitudes of beings, including us. Age of chaos is, is ended. Um, the supreme god disappeared. Prayers left unanswered. Smoke of offerings rises in vain to the heavens. No one knows where he went. This is the Ascension Wars. Okay, welcome to the world. In my home here in Machaca, I got a castle. And while I'm here, I can go do some recruiting. I can I can um, hire commanders or units to run on the battlefield. I can go and hire some mercenaries. We can bid for these mercenaries. Old Bernard's brave men. Um, we can change my setup. So, like, right now, uh, old Fami, Mafami over here, is, has got himself an army. And we can even change where these guys are, like, stationed. And what units, where they stand. So the spider stands over there, you know? Uh, the, the, leader, the, the dude, leader dude goes over there. My, um, my spearmen go there. Let's put them in a line formation. My other spearmen, uh, line formation. There you go. There's my, there's my commander. So we can adjust all this stuff. And that, that's a big part of the game, actually. Is figuring out where to people, where to stand people. Hey, Tracy. Another thing we can do is um, I like my spider. I like my spider to have units. So let's let the, the spider shall command. Um, what orders do we want to give them? Uh, what are you? You are. You got a short bow. Where did I put you? Oh, you're behind. Short bow's behind. Spears in front. Short bow. I want you to just stand there and fire. Spears. Just hold and attack. If someone comes up to you, you chew on them. That works for me. Uh, we'll give this guy. He'll just hang out there. Uh, we've got in the in the base. We got of course the spider. We've got the other leader. We begin with. Um, each of these guys are very important to look at because they all have different abilities. This guy he can walk through trees faster. But most importantly about leaders is they can they can have gear which we can craft. Um, some of them can do research. Some of them can cast spells, uh, which we we will get here in a second. Um, let's go ahead and send out 
my guy with stealth, he can walk around and, and spy on things and see what's out there in the world. Because there's other factions out there. There's neutral folks out there. And so he's going to go out there and do some sneaking around. Because that's what he, that's the kind of guy he is. Let's go to the old coast. Seems like a good place. Okay, so let's go buy some runes. Um, what I want is, I've got a, um, I've got a leader already, but I'd like to have someone that's just going to sit back and do some research. So we want someone that has a little bit of research ability like that. You can see lots of numbers, tons of numbers. I'm not going to go over all this stuff because I don't know a quarter of it, but I'll do my best. I've played quite a bit of Dominions, but still, I don't know a quarter of it. Um, actually, you're a pretty good researcher. You got 17. In order to, well, I'm just going to be this witch doctor here. I'm going to hire this guy. He's going to take some commander points to hire and some gold and some recruitment points, all this stuff to, um, to buy these guys. Yes, you can be a Cthulhu faction. That's correct. Um, and, when, and we're just going to get some, some... What do we want? Do we want spiders? I'll get some... We don't need anything too fancy just yet. And you can see, so we can go like, there's a little pygmy. Um, he has... He costs five gold. Four hit points. He's a little guy. Uh, he has no protection. No armor. He's out there naked. And you can see what he does. He's very weak. And you can get the militia guy, who has ten hit points. Still, um, no protection. No armor. But he's a, he's a little bit buffier, a little more buff. Just a militia. Then we can go up to the warrior, who does have a shield, which gives him still no protection. Um, but he's got the same hit points. He's got a little more defense skill in there. Uh, we can go up to the hoplite, who has all kinds of iron stuff, which means that he will have good protection against, uh, like, light infantry things. You can be volcano and devil people, too. That's right. That's right. <clears throat> yeah, every army needs a leader. Yes. You're a formation fighter. Um, value indicates extra nice. Mm, okay. Um, I think what I'm going to start with is I'll, I'll start with... We also get spiders. Spider riders. That's kind of neat. Um, we'll start with just some militia for right now. We'll get like a dozen militia. And then I'm going to get some spiders. I spent all my money. All my money on spiders. There we go. So then we'll get those next turn. And they'll pop out. And then we'll send them where they need to go. Uh, we can get some research as well. Which is... There? Nope. There. And let's go ahead and get some construction to make some better forts. Um, anything else to look at here? For the first turn. Um, there's me. What else we got here? Do we know who else is out there? Um, enchantments. There's all the Thrones of Ascension, which we can't see any just yet. Oh, yeah, we can. There's one. Oh, there's, there's one there and there. Okay. Both in the water. Turn into the world. So we got me. We have Yikilth. Atlantis. We got some water people. We have Jabalba. I'm not sure. Are those the monkey people? Uruk, the uh, the bone eaters. These are going to be like sort of a, a Middle Eastern myth focused. Ulm. Um, I know Ulm, but I forget what Ulm is. I forget. And then Flagrat. I don't know Flagrat. Ulm is. I think Ulm is like human. Shibaba are Mayan Batman. Oh, okay. Thanks, little bear. Okay. Anyway. Um, we got all these gems up here. We'll see what the gems mean shortly. And we'll use them to basically as a currency. We're going to spend this first turn, though. Ulm's the German human smith people. Okay. There's Ontinti, princess of courage, patron of, ma of merchants, lady of the obscure, has since the location of four previously undiscovered thrones. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, people are yelling out, hey, our god's here. Yeah, okay, cool. Master of Terror. Yeah, yeah, they're great. Okay, so we got some merfolk over here. Each of these these Ascension Throne things, you can, there's 120 of these merfolk there. Tough stuff. We've got 120 Wolf Tribe. That's actually kind of tough, too. Uh, we got 80 Light Infantries there, and we have 60 Light Infantry Cavalry, Heavy Cavalry. Know what you're going to be coming against, because depending on what you send out, it's going to be important. Heavy Infantry is going to have more defense, so your Light Archers aren't going to do anything to them. Um... Anyway, so let's go get our, our faction here, and, um, in fact, let me go to, 
this. We got a bunch of people out there. Hang out in the garrison here. Let's grab these guys and throw them into this army. And the spiders are going to be in their own their own army. There we go. You could lead three different factions here, different squads, up to 100 units, 100 living units. Actually, you can, I can have 100 dead units. Um, spiders, your job is to... Um, I'm not going to give you a um, hold and attack. I think it's okay. Maybe we shouldn't be holding so much. I'm staying you right there. I'm going to bump these these uh, marksmen back a little bit. Maybe we shouldn't be holding so much. I'm going to say just fire. And you guys just attack. I just attack until I figure out what I'm doing really well here. Okay. Okay. Got it. Um, let me say, you know, hold for a turn before you do things. Uh, I would like you to just sort of like stay behind troops would be a good idea. That'd be, that'd be ideal. I don't want you going out there and, and dying. We can use those gems to cast spells and things. Um, that we're grabbing here, which we're getting from our region. So the reason, the reason we want to conquer these other regions is because they're going to have, um, gear and items, uh, resources for us. Let's go over here to, uh, Avuka. I grab you. I'm going to bring in old boy here. Um... Wait, is Oboy the, um... It's Oboy the, um... Oh, he's the new guy, isn't he? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh boy. Um, your job... I remember how to do this. Is... Um... Is to research. You research. So we can get those 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 things in there. We'll, we'll probably make someone into a uh, prophet as well soon. You two are gonna go walking over here to Avoca and kill some things. Um, in town, I'd like to get a. I would like to get a prophet. A bane spider. Voice of the Lord. You sound like a good prophet. Priest level two. Ear of the Lord. You can do a little bit of glamour magic. You're stealthy. I'm gonna bring um I have the Lord. Let's bring in the voice of the Lord. Look at that guy. Woo! Freaky. Okay. Um And you see what it costs. Resources and gold. Um And we're gaining a bunch of that each turn. And each each territory gives me some of that. So Machaka's giving me this. When I conquer um, Avoca over here. It's going to give me more income, more resources, and all that. And each of these territories are going to have different things. This is like a plains territory, so it gives me more like um, income and stuff. Or this will give me more. This will give me even more income because it's farmland, plains, forest, and more resources. Um, the dominion. You can see what that is there. So as I as my dominion grows, those will increase. And so if you're like the hot people fighting against the cold people, it's going to be troublesome because cold things are bad for the hot people and hot things are bad for the cold. You get it. Ooh, a gateway to another, another plane. Exciting. There is a... Ooh, we can see the chambers underneath right there. Oh. Hey. Okay. 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 Uh, anyway, let's go kill these guys. There are... There are titans in the game. There's a few different. There's like uh, there's there's a like a Viking Norse faction that has like giants in it. Uh, there's a battle in Avoca. Let's go check it out. Let's watch. Now we get to watch. Hopefully things are going as we want them to go. So my spiders out there hanging out behind the troops. There goes my army. There goes their army. We sit back. We watch. They have some knights that we got to make sure we take out quickly. They like destroyed my my militia guys. My spiders are throwing webs out. Excellent. We're scaring some of them away. Yeah, they see a giant spider out there. I shouldn't have had him just stay behind. He needs to be doing things. Hopefully we don't lose this fight. That'd be embarrassing. But we got him webbed real good. There you go. Some horses are running away. We killed the guy on top. And you can click on these guys. Um... And you can see all their stats. And, like, you, you can kill the horse, or you can kill the guy on top of the horse. 
and there's a, there's strategies for all this. I like spook the horse or whatever, you know, and and then you don't have to deal with cavalry anymore. Some of my guys are running away. How cowardly! Lutinti's catching, casting bewitching lights. Here we go. Scare them all away. Spiders did some good chomping. My, my militia were kind of worthless. Also, I think I need I need I need you out there doing some things. There they go. Now they're running away. Okay. Look at that last that last straggler there. We win. We can click on it. We can see what happened here. We uh, we lost um, a few. Um, we lost three spider riders. They killed twenty. They did. They did a good job. Um, my archers killed nine. Lots of warriors died. In fact, a whole bunch of them and militia. All my militia died. And who we killed? They killed nineteen of us. Those heavy cavalry were pretty nasty, especially for the first fight. One of our guys. One of our spiders um, lost their mount. Okay, so now we've claimed this region, and now we're going to start getting in those resources, which is the reason we're claiming resource, claiming these places. Uh, we can recruit from different places, which are going to give us different things, right? This is a human, a human place. We can recruit some of those knights now, but we don't do that. We're spider people. We recruit spiders. And, and to, to think we would do other things is ridiculous. I think, I, you know what? Maybe we just bring in these spider knights, I recruit my points to get all those... Or, um, I'm not sure if it's a good idea. Let's do, um, you know what, let's do, how much are these guys? 14 gold, 27 resources. These are a lot cheaper. Let's just get some, just some, like, some front line. Some hop lights with, well, you know what? These guys are real weak. I think I like those spiders. These guys did do their job, so let's get some more of them. Yeah, yeah, feasting on the humans. Excellent, of course. They better be. Uh, this guy's job here, old, um, what's his face? He's gonna become a prophet. He's gonna spread dominion like the, like the, like the pretender god. Um, he's just a little slower. Let's do, let's do that. We'll let him do some, some preaching. And, um... 60 units there, 50 units there. We could take the militias we can handle. Heavy infantry is a little tougher. I think what we'll do is we'll maybe we'll go over here. Maybe we'll we'll stop back over here to pick up some units and then and then head back over there. Head over here. Um, in this province, I think we can. Um, we have a fort. We have a god force, which allows us to hire the these things. It also produces these gems. We have a god mountain. Allows us to hire all this stuff. Uh, what do we have over here? Nothing. Okay. I'm going to head back over there. Um, so magic item... So when we start getting some artifacts, we can start crafting things. I don't think we do anything just yet. Mercenaries, recruits. Um, okay. Commanders can use those things to cast spells. Okay, you guys go back there. Pick up some troops. Let's go back to the old coast. Let's see what we can do. It's, I think it's summertime now. Is that what it was? Uruk's yelling about things. What do you want? They got a profit. Okay, so... I would like you... to grab... Um, all these fellas. And, uh, yeah, grab these guys too. Oh, wait, not that, not that, not in that group. In your own group. Okay. 
Uh, your job is, is to not stay behind. Just decide for yourself which best course of action is. Excellent. You as well, buddy. Uh, it'd be nice to have, it'd be nice to have like a proper spellcaster, I think. Somebody who can actually do, some, do something here. Like a spider sorceress. Anansi. Oh, Anansi. I know Anansi. Spy. I think I want to get, yeah, let's get the spider sorceress in here. She's got fire magic, earth magic, death magic, glamour magic. Chance to summon one more monsters per month when it's in friendly dominion. That sounds exciting. Let's hire you. You, and then a bunch more spiders. Okay. Oh, Tinti is the stuff of nightmares, that's right. Um, let's go into here. Um, you, what was I going to do with this? Aren't you the, you becoming a prophet? Didn't I, didn't I say that for you? You're researching, and yeah, you become a prophet. Didn't I say that before? Did I, did I cancel it? Probably. Um, let's see. I'm trying to remember. I'm, it's been a while. I'm trying to remember some of these things. Um, what, what I did know. I'm trying to remember some of it. Um, let's see. So we can we can put defense in our towns, correct? Isn't that a, that's a thing we can do? Def no, no, don't defense. You go into there. Wow, that's a lot. Ardent, 255, that's a lot of dwarves. Our armies have supply. Seed strength of us. Province defense. There it is. Okay. We spent our money on province defense. That's the button. Thank you. Thank you, Master Lith. Okay. Get something in there just just to get some defense in that town. Okay. Next. Okay, there's a battle on the old coast. How do we do? We did excellent. So we watched the battle? Yeah, because we did pretty good there. So let's watch the battle. Make sure everything happened the way we wanted it to. I hope my spider did his job. Here they come. Imagine how terrified you'd be if you saw this thing coming at you. I wouldn't be doing that, that's for sure. I'd be going that way. That web's pretty nasty. Well, maybe. Stopping him anyway. Ooh, he spits out black spider webs. I'm not sure if friendly fire is a thing, but there is a lot of arrows flying in here that seem like may not be a good thing. When things get damaged, you can see the, um, um, a lot of that shows up in here as well. You can get, like, um, you can get scarred or, or maimed or whatever as well. I think, I think there is friendly fire. Yeah, because a lot of damage just went in there and, and <laughs> definitely wasn't that one guy. I think we were just, like, destroying our own people. Um, good job. Good job, archers. Okay. Now, we own the, uh, the old coast. Excellent. Old coast. Let's get some defense in here. Okay. There we go. How much do you have in, in here? 25. Okay. Um... It's a tough fight over here. 110 over this way. There's only 50 over, 60 over here. We can go grab that real quick. This is planes. We don't know what it's gonna give us. Up over here. Where's my? Uh, where's my? There he is. I forgot about you, buddy. Um, let's go walk over this way. Okay. Now. Let's bring in these black hunters are kind of scary looking. I think I'm going to try to to get away from archers because they're, they're not doing me any good for all melee here. These spiders. 
still only have 10 hit points. They have both a spear and a bow, so we could use them as as archers, I suppose, if we wanted to. Um, what about the knight? What's he have? He has a spear. They don't use bows. Spiders can throw webs at enemies from a distance. And they have a whole bunch of armor. 12 hit points, 17 protection. So these guys are way better, of course. We can we can hire a few of these guys for next time. Um, I've got um, are you the new um, you're the new guy, right? Voice of the Lord. You're the voice of the Lord. Who are you then? You're the sorcerer. Oh, I guess I did hire you for that. Well. Did I tell you to become a prophet? Am I missing something here? Hmm. I do want you to go search for magic sites. I don't know if we can do it here, but that'll help us find these gems. Yeah, Glamour is a new one. It replaces some uh, air spells. So a lot, of, uh, yeah, there's like slight changes to a lot of little things in here for the difference between five and six. Um, let's grab our people. We should be able to walk in here just easy, easy enough, so we'll go ahead and take that one out. There's a bit of unrest with this town, but that one's going down. This one will still spend a little more money to get a little more unrest down. There we go. Just make sure that one gets, gets cleared out. Okay, and I want... Um, I think I want also to bring in... There she is. Okay, so she don't, she'll be here in a minute. Not enough recruitment points for her, I guess. Terrain do anything against your units? Yeah, well, we get a little bit... Because we got the, like, four survival or whatever, it helps us, helps us walk. Um... Yeah, it does. It does affect, especially. I think what affects more is like the, um, I forget the word, um, like if it's hot or cold, that's what affects it more. How do we do? Lost a few folks, but stomped across them pretty easily. Okay, that's in Honoria. We got a few more neutrals here. We got forty units, but they're all heavy infantry, which means our bows won't do anything to them, and we have some. Uh, militia, light cavalry, heavy cavalry. The we don't know how many of what is in each one. It shouldn't be too difficult to take out. And oh, this is a small map, and it does wrap, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Are you still um, not recruited? What do I need? Oh, I did get you. Where are you? There you are. All right. So Sawatu, I want you to be a like a uh, a leader. So go ahead and let's get you. Some spiders. You go with her. You can only command ten units. Okay, so she's going to be more of a not a not a honor her own kind of leader. She's going to be have to join the party. Okay. Um. Well, I can run you. I'll run you. Well, guys, you can grab those. Grab a few. Grab some spiders. And then let's go over here for now. And what we'll do with these guys is we'll move them down here. And you down here. Claim that one. The original Dominions 1 was in 2003. Oh, 2002, that's what I saw earlier. I, um, it's one of those games that I had, like, I bought Dominions 3, I think, I think I had 3, Dominions 3, I think maybe even 3 and 4, uh, that I, I never played them, though, like, they were in my, I bought them on, like, GOG or something like that, whenever this, there was, um, a sale at some point, but I never actually, I never played them until 5 came out, then I played quite a bit, and it, here we go, um, that's for chatting with people. Um, I've always had a lot of fun with it. It takes me a minute to remember what I'm doing here. Some brave men. Well, they're already being hired by everyone else. Okay. 
my treasure, my magic in my treasury. Nothing in there. The ascension, research. How are we doing research? Are we getting anywhere? We got level, we're almost, almost level two. Not too many games you can uh, mass a screen full of skeletons to terrorize everyone. That's true. That's true. Right, next turn. I think uh, Daz and them have a multiplayer game going right now, actually. I think of this. Daz and Lucid Tactics and Battle Moose. Here are the, um, the minions, folks. Hey, construction research is complete. All right. Um... Talamu, the voice of the Lord, search the old coast for magic. Did you find anything? No magic sites here. Okay. Um, no magic sites or a more skilled mage is needed. A battle in Lorboro. Okay, we lost some. Ooh, I'm kind of curious how that happened with the uh, with my archers getting whooped. Curious. We'll speed it up a little bit here. Looks like I need more spiders. Someone get three, is that what happens? But he got him here. Oh, this their archers are mowing down on me. We can select, like, we could set up a separate group that is just, like, kill the archers. And so they focus on archers. Uh, army size was increased drastically in Dominion 6 up to 1,000? They're playing a three, but three v three v three v three v three game against computer opponents. Oh, nice! It was a lot of fun. I it was like what five years ago or whatever. I did that multiplayer game with Daz and Battle Moose and Lucid. It was a lot of fun. I don't do a lot of multiplayer things with other YouTube folks. That was a good time. Uh, what happened in Lurboro? Sea dogs are attacking the coastal settlements. Lead on their frenzied hunt by a proud. Uh, Ictisentar. Ictisentar. And that those sea dogs attacked me. Hmm. As we came in, there some sea dogs came in. Did I get, oh, I did. I did all right. Um, I'm trying to remember who won. I remember who won. I did. I did all right. I did. A lot, I did a lot of like playing beforehand to make sure I knew what I was doing. And I just, I played as Satis, as a lizard folk, and, um, did okay. I think me and Daz got into a bit of a war. And, um, Sabout, Sabout's one, Sabout's one. So I don't know if, I don't know, uh, I don't remember if, I think, I think Daz and I, like, we just had some border skirmishes, I think, is really all that really happened there. That's an event. And so one of the things we can do is we can adjust whether um, there's more or less, like, events in our land. That was one of the scales that we could add in. Um, that's where that would come in. <clears throat> cool lab with spider cats. I have not. I have not. Okay, so I want these folks to go and walk into um, here, join up. We're going to get them all gathered up real good. And then, you know what? We actually, like, we almost circled the world here. Oh, hey, look, there's the, um, there's lobster riders. What? <laughs> so there's where you can see. This. So this is their dominion, the red candles there. And so they've got order, productivity, cold, uh, growth, and luck, and drain. Uh, so... Drain's actually a bad one. So they got cold. So cold's not going to be good for us. Um, we got heat there. So we're going to try to spread that out as best we can to make it not, you know, to, to help us out here. Um, and, but yeah, yeah. I keep forgetting about you. Go look over here to the forest. Saran Forest. That's where they make the wrap. Um, you're searching over here. I'm going to go ahead and increase the defense here just in case there's some funny business. Over this way. I'll do it here too. I'm sure we got some some folks hanging out. Twenty should be plenty. Fortune and misfortune increase event chance. Oh, they both in they both increase it. Just which one does does good or bad? That makes sense. Uh, here in Machaka. Let's recruit some things. I'm gonna get more of these spider knights. 
Um, I'd like, you know what, let's get a, let's get this guy. He seems pretty cool. He's got a priest level one, not much of a caster. He's sacred, which means he does the cool, so the sacred units are the ones that do what the god, like that, um, what do you do, like experience boost or whatever, or like raising the, that, that, those are, um, sacred units, sacred units. At the end of the game, sacred units are like nasty. Like that's, that's end game stuff. Um. I'm not sure where I was going with that, but that, that's where you end up going end game is with the you can really buff these units up crazy times. Um let's see. We could recruit, I suppose, from here. If we want some some infantry or like a priest or something. Well, we had a temple. A little short on resources. We can only hire one guy because we have no resources in this place. We can bring in some infantry. Just give us something there. Daz loves sacred units. Yeah, um, I mean, you can really, like, roll over, like, early on, you know, it's pretty even battlefield, but if you really focus on those, those sacred units and, um, spend those gems crafting magic items for your people, you can, you can make some pretty nasty units. Like, where... One guy can like stomp across like my army would be nothing one with one guy. Okay, so you, um, I'm gonna put you guys all together. I want I want you in there as well. And and your job, let me go uh, go in here. Your job, old Sawatu, um, is is to. Oh yeah, what kind of spell do I, I can cast specific spells? That's right, and I can tell you what to do. Um, I want you just to sleep ray like you've sleep rayed before. Never sleep ray. I don't know what I want. Um, you can change shape. Can you do that? No, no, don't do that. What shape do you change into? Is that a thing you do? Are you a shape changer? You are a shape You shape change into a great spider? <laughs> okay. Okay, so you sleep ray, and then, and then... And then you're going to cast... Summons a malign spirit from the underworld and coerces it to curse an enemy. In return, it is set free to wreak havoc on the living. The spirit never joins battle. That costs a gem. That's pretty neat. But no, and then, and then cast whatever you want. Then you can change shape. And then you can go get him. Because that's kind of neat. Uh, and you can stand wherever you want. I don't care. Uh, these spiders, I'm going to go ahead and toss these guys to be commanded by you. i got really no units here left with these other groups. Um, we need some spiders in this group. We can go over here. I'm a little concerned about these guys walking into my, into my spot. Or we can keep on trying to get... Um, do I, how, how many people feel about water? They probably don't like it too much. Not so much. Okay. Um, we can probably go into... Let's keep on just marching here. Can we march in here okay? We need, we need some sort of like research to get the water walking or whatever. That's, that's, that's Uruk right there. Okay, so we know where two of them are. We need to get a second... second group here, which that's what I'm trying to work on. You and and spiders. This is going to be just spider spider group. And they can probably... I'll bring a few more spiders in. Like, if we're going to be just just spiders. Just spiders. It'd be cool to have, like, a like a caster, though. You cast spells? No. So, they have this for survival. Helps with, helps with, with supplies. Okay. Um... You cast spells. You don't cast spells either. You're not a very you're you're, not, you're sort of a priest. You're a level two priest. Um, I'll I'll put you in there, and you can hop into this group too. Okay. You just want to start with. I'm a complete noob. I've always heard that um the man um, what's it called um. Whatever of man is like the I talked about at the very beginning, like the, like the, just like the medieval empire people, knights, 
you know, footman, bowman, very basic, nothing too crazy. I've always heard that's that's the one to start with, is like the basic one. Hey, T Kitty, how's it going? Oh, the, the throne of zeal has been claimed by uh, by by this fella. That's one of the, the places. No magic. Nation of man, Ohm's a good a good one. One of my units uh, died during the march from Lobro to... S which one? No dying. No dying allowed. Who died? Oh, hey. She's a she's a, she's a a spider now. <laughs> cool. Uh, what was the other stuff? Um, a battle. Let's go see the battle. I want to I want to see um, Anansi do the job. So Anansi, you turned into a great spider? Nice. I want to watch it. Olm is pure defense. So these guys, like these horses with knights, are going to be pretty tough. But if we can like web them down and then just stomp. Where did Anansi run off to? There he is. He's out there doing his casting. Low magic is probably yeah. Anything that's low magic is probably the best, the best to pick early on. And I've always heard don't go with late age. Stick with the earlier mid. Is um is easier for for newbies. Yeah, your units will upgrade. The other units get experience. And that's kind of our. That's what I picked. Uh, the well, the sacred units get experience boost. Like the sound of my spiders. They're, they're screaming out, Praise on Tinti. Hope there's no one with arachnophobia out there. Because it is kind of terrifying. Where's Anansi at? Is that is that Anansi right there? Is that just a... That's just, a, I think, a spiderless... A riderless spider. A famous hero. A new famous hero. Stories of uh, Mimfalmi's brave deeds of extraordinary agility are now told by bards and storytellers all over the world. Excellent. Well done, buddy. I don't know what you did, but I'm proud of you. Okay, there's a line in the world. Okay, so in our, our new home, defense. And we got a whole group here now, which I would like you to join them. I'm going to give you some spiders. Or just one giant mass of spiders. I don't care what you guys do. Just go out there and chomp on things. This guy's... Uh, going to just cast spells. You have you have you have all kinds of yeah smiting demons like that. That's that's good. You just stay back there, smite demons. Okay, I guess I can put you in a certain spot here. Like I I can put you back a little bit. Okay. Now you two, um, let's go. You know what? Maybe this guy. I got this guy as a researcher, but he's got three nature magic, so he can probably do some neat. Neat things. Maybe we should bring him along. Yeah. I'll get a new guy for this. You three. We can handle this. There's 120 of them, which is a lot. That's okay. Okay. And then you guys. 90 of them. Heavy infantry is going to be kind of tough. Barbarians we can handle. Go over there. How's my armor looking? Uh, looking a little weak, actually. Probably need to get some more people over here. That guy's searching. What can we? What can we recruit here? Horsies. None of resources around here. Um, I don't really want to like hang out and not attack, but I think, I think we're gonna have to. I've never done a um a water faction before. I've never been brave enough to try to to try to do that. Let's do a little bit of enchantment just to see if we can get something something new. Okay. Um.
Plenty of knights. Load a demon lord with artifacts that can clear entire armies. Yeah. Yep. Atlantis has found their queen, which means they've got like so they their their god wasn't out immediately, and they're they're now popping in. A battle in Mag. We uh, we lost a spider knight, but we lost well we lost a unit on there. Yeah, uh, this was oh this is the new the new battle. Let's see. Let's take a look at these guys. This is the new people. These are, the, these are the knights. I don't think I've got the knights before. There they go. Yeah, so they're they're just spider knights. A little tedious. And we also have this guy, the, the tarantula guy. There's some fireflies going in. Hey, Mino. Yeah, if, if you like, if you figure out the magic real well, then you can make some nasty stuff too. Because you can go in there and, especially if you do it right, where you um, you set up your magic for your god, and you can have some like proper buffs. Like as soon as the game starts, as soon as the battle starts, buffs go all over the place, and then your um, your um, your special units, sacred units, get buffed immediately, and then they stomp across everything. So there's 30 units. There's, there's some maidens and of the moon and uh, some Enkidu soldiers over this way. This is uh, this is um, Babylon, whoever. Um, Uruk, Uruk is the name. Where's my uh, my my hidden dude? There he is. Let's go look over this way. Can I go over there? Okay, go over there. You can't go over there. You can go there. Then I see. Go that way. Oh, they took it. Five units, heavy cavalry. We can take that. They might have a defense there by the time we get there. We got it. Let's just try it. See what happens. Um, if I can get anyone in here, there might be some more stuff there soon. But that's okay. Let's go take them out. Who's this? This is. Oh, this is Uruk as well. So they're they, okay. They're all around here. One of those guys. What do these spider warriors do? Arc vision, force fire. They're stealthy, so they can like sneak in places, like around without you being seen. Spider armor. These are my assassins, so we can use them to go and um, and kill heroes. Like if we see a hero, like if some, like they, they could pop an assassin in and try to kill my hero in here. Okay. There's a lot of battles going on. A battle in Ederal. Okay, we whooped some some uh, barbarians. Oh, these are this is Uruk. We 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 just fought. Okay. Excellent. We whooped them. My home. The fifteen to give us where we get two. Twenty. Okay. And what we're trying to get we're hopefully trying to get this Dominion. And you can see it's starting to get there, it's getting warm over here. Okay, Mag's been conquered. Yeah, when we set up the game, we had a chance. We had an option to change it to wrap around or not. Um, I'm gonna worry about that one a little bit. I wonder if we can buy a mercenary. Bernard's brave men. He's got these guys. Rourke's hiring him at the moment. Ooh, there's a way down there to another plane. Right there. Huh. I haven't I haven't seen this before. Is that is that new? I don't remember. Um. I don't remember this being in five or, or earlier. I think the the underworld is is new. There's always a sky one. I think. Might be the, getting this confused with Conquest of Elysium.
Make me a bunch of those guys. And then... So in the Saran Force, what do we have here? 230 units. Marcata archers, Marcatas, and archers, and infantry. So a whole bunch of folks are in there. But that's that's a... Um, actually, that's the one where the, uh, the stuff is. A bunch, bunch of people over there. Reckless Woods. There's another one over here in the Dragon Scale Mountains. Oh, there's the other guys. There's, um... There's Ulm. You hang out over there. Okay. What do you got? Wolf tribes? Wolf tribe folk. I should really... Uh, These guys over here. Let's, see, let's figure out some diplomacy here. Um. Oh. How about an aggression pact? What do you say? Buddy. I wonder how far north it goes. Skip a turn. Mm. So there's some dormant gods are starting to wake up. A handful of gems have been found in a deep ravine. We found four earth gems. Excellent. Excellent. I haven't really used my gems yet. And... I don't have um, a lot of ability, I don't think, because my casters don't have many spells for it. I cannot enchant things just yet. I can't make items yet. So I think we need research before we can do much much of that. The so two of the thrones have been grabbed already. It would be nice to grab some of these things. Let me get uh, this guy to go and see what's in this zone here. And... What do we get? What do we get? Like the water, the water ability. Is it? A, is that enchantment? We can enchant ourselves. Like a cast a spell, enchant ourselves to go underwater. Just conquering this land and having some priest or someone of, of level go stand in there. What's over there? 100 units, infantries. Let me run these guys back over here for now. Stay there. I'm gonna run you. Um, well, those are monkeys, aren't they? Oh yeah, monkeys. There's monkeys in there. So let me get these guys. We're gonna pop in here. Grab some more soldiers. We're just going all night. So let's just try to go all night and see what happens. Um, fire magic. I need research. Um, I'll take a black sorcerer. Gonna take a couple turns to get you get you brought in, but we'll see. Right. Yes, yeah, let's uh, let's go chat with Ulm. What do you say? Uh, sign of disrespect towards Untinti. Uh huh. Uh huh. There shall be no non-aggression pact between Machaka and Ulm. How dare you? The only beast has been claimed. No magic. I 
Okay, so all these spiders are going to go in, <clears throat> in here. Two units of hideous spiders. Two groups of spider knights. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Um, and then I want you guys to come back over here. This way. And, um, yeah, so I can make... Let's see here. Here's alchemy. Turn gem. There, it's what I'm looking for. Um, this is the pearls. And then... Magic item. That's what we want. What can I make here? Ring of Fire gives us fire resistance. Snake green poison resistance. Um... Wolf Pelt will enrage its wear, increasing its strength and battle prowess, reducing its defense. Shield. Uh, what's that one do? Nope, no bardings. Hey, Hi Foss. How are you? Immunity from heat and flames. Um, I'm just remembering we're fighting what was going to have that. Increase morale. Sure, make one of those. We'll wait here a turn and do, and do some of that. Blood hunt, which is which is bad for your province. Empowerment. Use large quantity of gems. As, uh, commander can learn new magic path. Can better it as one he already knows. Which can I do that with with uh, what's his face? I can do it with my god. But with with um, Mtume. I can do that. Okay. Well, eventually. Okay. Uh, we'll wait here for... Wait, wait. You... What rituals can we do here? Uh, let's find some roots, some animates, human skeletons, thus created, are known as mannequins. Hmm. The undead leadership, but my guy can can do that, can't he? Ten nature gems. Yes, yeah, summon some animals. Why don't you? Uh, I do have a mage searching for sites. Yeah, uh, he's over here. Okay, so you're going to make your way back. Slowly. And then in this place, we want to recruit some more. I want some more of these spider knights. Next turn. Okay, animal summons. Excellent. Uh, the carcass of a dead shambler washed ashore during one of the, <clears throat> the worst storms in the memory. The creature's skin was fashioned into a piece of armor. Hey. Nice. Okay. So, now this armor. Do I want to give it to you? I think I want to give it to... I think... Yeah, you. I think I want to give it to you. The voice of the hunters. Right? You're a, you're a, a fighty dude? Yeah. You. There you go. Hit points. Hey, water breathing, huh? Okay. Because he can... So I've got him searching, but he can only search... Where is he at? He can only find... Um, oh, he can't only find anything, because he, he needs... You need someone that has... I forgot about that. You need someone that has the path, like this guy. Has fire, whatever. He can find stuff in those paths, right? I'm remembering now. So we need another one of these guys to actually do the, the searching. Okay. I am recalling some things. Um, I, I would like you to be a prophet. And then do whatever you do. Okay. And then fill this army back up again. Um, oh, look at all those animals. 
<laughs> okay, spiders go into the spider group. Uh, animals will be led by... Uh, do you want a group of animals? Yes, you do. Undisciplined animals? Perfect. Send them in there first. All right. Nice. Okay. Uh, what should I do with my what should I do with my cash? I forget I forget how to how to build things in my uh, in my place. How to construct? Forts all over. Can I build a fort here? Temples and forts, provinces to spread dominion. How do I make them? Mm. Hey, boo. How's it going? Priest build temples. Mages build labs. Anyone can build a fort. Okay. So he can construct things. Okay. Okay. Build temple. bring in, so that guy before that we had doing the search, and we should find someone that, that can do it well, which I think was, was it the witch doctor or was it that guy? Witch doctor does those three. And he, he comes up with a mystery one. Let's bring in him. And we'll let him do some some hunting. Have a good one, boo. Think about spacing on forts. They draw the build resources from neighbor provinces. Okay. Okay. Um, so we can hang out here for a minute. What's there? Is that 100 units there? Let's go take that one out. Work our way up to there. I think this army is probably good enough to handle that and take that thing out. We could also spend a turn doing some building or whatever. Um, what am I more scared of? Am I scared of the monkeys or am I scared of these guys? And Kidu. Let's go there first. Okay, so now this guy, what I want you to do. Um first. Let's go. What kind of ritual spells can we do? So many animals, mannequin. Um, I just want you to go and search. Uh, Where's my auto search? Search for sites. There we go. Okay, temple built. Um, admin, recruitment points, bonus points. Okay, make one of those. Let's bring in... Um, I want another one of these guys. Give me a couple of those and a bunch of spiders. Come here, grab, and, grab some folks over here. Uh, in this province, though, uh, maybe we just stay here for a minute. No, no, go back down there. Uh, but in this province, you have those. Okay, we'll let, we'll let it be. Uh, next year.
Okay. Ooh, big fight. My hawks, my deer, um, my rats. Excellent. Ooh, that's a lot of spider knights. We got a bunch of them, though. We got, the, got a couple commanders. Okay. That was a big fight right here. The Dead Marshes. I've heard of that one before. We're in their dominion here. So it'd be a good idea, I guess, from now that we're in their dominion to make a building. Like a palisade. It takes five months for that. It's a long time. I want to see it for five for five months. Oh wait, wait, wait. Somebody had it. Um Throw a temple in here. Okay, so over here. Um, you come on with me. Is there any, any building we can do in this place? No. My animals. Excellent. Hang out with the, with the archers. Put you in there. And move you over here. Okay. We'll do one turn here. Magic site. Hey, we found a magic site. In uh, in here, we found a song of birds. Hey, it produces a glamour gem. Nice. Another battle in Zenthra. Uruk came in to attack me, but we killed him. Over here. Can we go down there now? We can, we can jump down here now? We can. We can go pop in. Maybe? Who is that? You guys, let's see if we, can do it, if we can go here. Oh yeah, I can go right there. I see. And that's that's the other folks. Okay, cool. Okay, so that that thing's been built, right? Um, temple is there. Excellent. Why don't we make another building? Five months for this. I'm going to do this because it's where that cave is. So let's make a palisade there. Sure. Um, and you over there finding some gems. A lab. Sure. You still making those palisades? Okay. I want everyone else... To go and let's make our way over this way. More spiders. Um, no, no, one of those. Mm. 
Another one? Uruk is very angry. Leave me alone. Let me, let me keep my place. Uruk is, uh, you guys. Okay. Ooh, look at that army. Think they're coming this way? How long till you done? Two months remaining. Let's move over there. Adderall's kind of going to get hit hard. We can at least weaken them when they, whenever they get to us, if uh, they actually are coming my way. Okay, buff you up a little bit. Okay, and in uh, this place here. Let's go here. Uh, people are starting to worship false pretenders in the secrecy of their homes. In where? Loreborough? Famous hero stories of Kajani's brave deeds. Well done, Kajani. Yeah, yeah, you're the best. You're building that palisade. I couldn't do it. That's why you're such a hero. Okay, so you guys are building palisades, defending, and their army disappeared. Perfect. Is that palisade still not done yet? One month remaining. Okay. Can you bring in... I'd like you to bring in... These are the... Oh, you're not sacred. You're just, you're just sneaky, right? You're the sneaky guys. There's all Anansi. Anansi's pretty cool. Nancy causes unrest, apparently. Okay, we don't have a whole lot here, so we probably can't take out this stuff. Um, I'm going to bring them... I mostly just want to bring them over... Well, let's see what we can build first. Throw a lab in first. And then over here, Palisade next turn. Any recruiting we can do over here? A couple priests. Folks on horse. Which can't afford any of them. Hey, Palisade done. Nice. Okay, we got a Palisade now. Uh, this is a whole bunch of archers, which you could probably handle pretty easily, but there's a big army right there. Do we want to go stomp in there? Do we want to take out this thing up to the north? Um, I think we've got a good sized army here now. Sort of. Yeah, there's is there three levels? Three levels of fort? Palisade, and then fort, and there's one more or something? Or is it just the two? Two months remaining. Um... Lab and Palisade. And you guys... Um, turn. Hey, Adam, how's it going? Woo. Empowered. Magic sight. Enchanted pyre. Is that fire magic? Uh, I expected an event in Anoria. We got misfortune and unrest. And cursed units. A new hero. Umtumi. Yeah, he's great. 
Worldwide event. People's death match. The people's death match is scheduled in the arena. Spellcast is not allowed. All participants will get to be able to borrow a slave collar. Okay. Each god may send one champion, and all the arena champions must try to defend the title, defying the rules if necessary. An arena. All right. I was driving home the other day, and uh, I heard on the radio that this truck loaded with uh, with Vicks vapor rub had overturned on the highway. So I was kind of worried, you know, traffic and all that, but for the entire eight-hour drive, there was no congestion. Is Vicks available in other countries? Is that something that people know what Vicks is? I hope so. Otherwise, that joke doesn't really work. You. Um, oh, I can tell you to compete. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Mega Fortress. Who can I send? Who should we send? Let's send this guy. You, you're not going to die, are you? It is a death match, I suppose. Go, go, go get him. Oh, they're all going? Um, yeah, okay. This is one. Okay, good, good, good. I'm gonna move you guys into here. Just in case things weird things happen here, because I don't know what's gonna what that's gonna do. I have a clue. Um I would run away or, or go fight this, but I think maybe we should uh, hang out with here. You're building a fortress. Excellent. Can I tell you to, to help with that fortress? No. Okay, yeah, yeah. Let's just um, hang out here for a minute. Want me for a lab? Oh, mages for labs. Which would be like you. Right. Okay. Okay. Um... more holy points. Okay. Alright, what are you doing there? Why don't you come up here? Um, actually, you've got the, both the lab and the song of birds there. What else were you doing here? Little palisade there. Does that do anything for me other than just it give me your recruitment points? Deathmatch, you win or you die. We'll find out. Um, events. Deathmatch is taking place. Um, my black sorcerer. Dead. Okay. Might have just sent the one guy in. That, that's good. That's good. Uh, Aristeus, the flagrant tyrant, won the death match. Good. Good for him. Okay. Good. He didn't send everyone. He just sent the one. Uh, did you, um, here, go work on that, that fort. Okay, get that fort done, please. And I need a, um, I need someone, like, let's say you, to go be a prophet. And I need you... Um... We could turn some of these, like, nature gems into something. Well, what do we have any use for the glamour gems? Take that shield. And you. Yeah, meh. Yeah. Uh, 
Um, I don't have research, do I? You, are you good at research? Not really. You're not, you're not awful. Do some research. No, I, 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 I know he got whooped. I didn't mean to send him in. Was there death matches in the other dominions? I don't remember seeing them before. Here we go. What do we got? We got the the amphibian dude. Big glaive. Stabby stab. Ooh, spider change. Oh, spider change did. <laughs> okay. More spiders. Let me try. Um. Hey, um. Uruk. Friend. What do you say? What do we recruit here? We recruit some archers. Just get some heavy infantry in this place. A couple commanders in there too. Actually, you know what? Just um Throw in those. Some of these guys. Get somebody in here. Oh, hey, look at that. We can just do these guys now. Uh, yeah, give me some more. These dudes. A little low on resources. This place is getting cooler. It was a shameful display. My champion, he's the worst. I'm going to go take this. I think we can do it. I'm tired of um, not taking it. So you guys go stand with him. Uh, the horses can go with the uh, animals. I'll let the animals be, command be commanded by this guy. I don't care what you do. Oh, mine's too morale. I don't want that one. I want happy animals. They're kind of bringing my knights down, though. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, Knight, your orders. I'm going to stand you over here. And I want you to get to attack archers. Go around, kill archers. See if that works. There isn't any archers here, I don't think. Maybe. Oh, yeah, light infantry. There's a few. Okay. Machaka. Wish after shall be known as the prophet of Undindi. Excellent. Um, that battle I just did. Okay, we whooped him. There's a whole bunch of them. Took him out. On this rainy day, good day for a fight. Jump, jump. That was good. Uh, made me feel better from that. That arena just, uh, you know, the arena fight was just like, not okay. That made me feel better. Uh, Palisades complete. Um, Machumba, the ape oracle, appeared at the gates of your castle. Rumor that there's a great city in the god forest where apes rule instead of men. Few believe this myth until the ape oracle was found. Oracle is an ape of uncanny intelligence captured by the eye of the Lord after she and her band caused some unrest in a remote region of the kingdom. Grew to be quite clever, but not clever enough to avoid capture. Released by the forces of the Lord of when Mwaka, crowned ape, arrived and made a plea for the Oracle's life. Mchumba seems to be the only slightly brighter than an ordinary ape. 
She has some innate magical powers. Excellent. Monkey God. I love it. You can do some research. Nature magic. And empower you to make you even cooler. Can I make you better with uh, nature? That'd be cool. 30 nature gems. I need, I need a bunch of those. I could swap some of my stuff out and make you even better at nature. Anything new here that you can do? This is just what, what I do. I think I'll just let you do some research. Just give you some doing something. Okay. So fort complete. Um, to build another fort. Three months. Uh, let's hold off on that because I want to do some. I want to see if I can get up here and get this thing without dying. So we'll bring. Do we want to bring everybody? I'm bring someone, leave someone behind. There's the fort defense. So we'll bring everybody. Um, and in here, let's recruit some things. What can, what can we afford here? A bunch more of these jerks. Oh, and this guy. What if we get someone like... I don't have any command... I have enough commander points. Somebody can do like a little bit of magic. Or even... Um, yeah, we'll get that guy. He'll come in like next turn. And I'm going to bring... These guys, we'll leave, we'll leave all your lock behind. And then we're going to go... Oh, I don't know, we're going to go to the monkeys. Let's go to the monkeys. Okay. Uh, all you spiders... On the spider. Here. Okay, building a fort. You, I think I want I want you doing something more exciting. Like building a lab. Uh, important here. Not required to recruit mages and mages from that's only we can make mages in that place. Do I really care about that? I don't think so. But like over here, building like a temple is good. For sure. So build a temple. Uh, the rest of you, let's go over here. The Dominion is going to give us like the, um, the order, productivity, and, and the heat or whatever that we want with part of our Dominion. Gives us more resources, more more um, income. Okay, you go in there. You go in there. Make a bunch of those guys. Swimming. Oh, you know what? Can I not get these guys? I want these guys. How do I get these guys? I got money. How do I bid for these guys? Maybe they're not available just yet. I want them. I guess I'll just, take a, I'll just take an army of um, 
the archers. I can just bring some archers in. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, there we are, talking to these guys, and they are now disrespecting us again. Trackless Woods battle. We, um... We, we killed some... Um, oh, that's them. That's them killing these guys. Oh, wait, you know what? That, that's, um... I don't know what that is. That's me in the Saran Forest, which we won. Fortress done. Uh, that's... He oh, that's... Where was that? Trackless Woods, that's there where they were attacking. That's where I want to go. That's that's where I'm gonna go now. Bear tribe over there. I think I would rather hit here. Get some monkeys in here. I think Rurik was in, was in the game before. Um, you know, just just repeat. Just keep making those things. I forgot we could do that. That's that's a button. Um. Yeah, in fact, come over here. Let's just repeat. Just make them spiders over and over again. Um... You guys, who's in here? Nothing. Uh, why can't you go over here? Hmm. Stay there. Can't I move my guy over here? I don't know. Um, anyway, while you're here, though, might as well do something. Go ahead and um, build that. Skull! Have a good one. Let's see if we can get this trackless woods and take one of these things. Let's see if we can get this. We gotta get three of these things to to win. I guess it three or is it five? Um. Anyway, let's see if we can get in there and get that. I'm gonna stop here for a minute, but let's go. Let's go here to Tiffia. Everybody, pounce in on Tiffia. Let's take that one out. And you, uh, this place. Recruit a bunch of monkeys. Excellent. Um. Have a sizable army here too, don't we? Yeah. Look at all those things. They're all mostly defending. Grabbing these spiders though. Let's just grab these spiders. Um, this guy, you come along, buddy. And let's go into there. Can we bid on these guys yet? I want the swimming swimming men. I guess we can't because. Oh, can I put them in? You guys go there. If I select this province, can I get them? I might, I might need to have a water province to get them in. I think he's been led by. I'm not sure what you mean by that. Um, I got a bunch of folks here, not led by anybody. Just in in garrison. This is just the um, my army that came up through this way. These are all pretty much just open. There's no one in this army, though. I don't know how to move. Well, I'm not sure why these guys aren't moving. What the... Oh, because he's building Palisade. That's why. Ha <laughs> ha. That's why. Wait. Is it why, though? I can move him there. I can't move him there. Hmm. Go down here. 
Oh, there is a river there. Oh, you're right. There's a river there. Yep. Yep. I see it now. Okay. Make spider knights. And you... Um, yeah, barbarians are cool. That's how we got there before. When it freezes, we can walk across it. When it's not, we can't. Yeah, that's right. Tiffia, which is us walking over there. We lost one knight. Killed everything else. Cool. Which is there. So now we're going to keep on marching here. They got big dudes over there. Uh, everybody over here. In this province, let's get some defense. Right, swimming or flying or whatever, we can get across it. There, and then we're going to go up to Trackless Woods and take that one. Uh, this army that's here, because this is a sizable group, right? Yeah, well, it's these, yeah, plus those big spiders. Let's move you. Let's go down here. Let's walk in there and take these guys out. Yeah, I, th remember, I remember the way you get these, these water ones. Probably the best way, if I remember right, is to just take a place that can raise water walking dudes. Or walk sw swimming things. And then we can just raise an army of swimmers and go take it out. If we can find one of those. Like this. Turtle warriors. Amphibious. Make up a whole bunch of those. A whole bunch of those led by one of these guys. Maybe a couple of them. And then we can go out. Ooh, are we there? Hey, Baka. There, there, and then... Alright, everybody. Oh, you should be going somewhere. Okay, so that went into along with a few spiders. Oh, a few spiders. Um, you know what? There's 150 of them. How many of, of me are there? Not 150. 52. What are we hiring here? On a bunch of these things. Okay. Are they gonna come at me? We'll find out. Hey, enchantment's done. Okay, Tiffia battle. We got Uruk versus um, these folks. Me. Um, we fed them, fed them off. There's not too many of them. Mile deep was the one down below. This is this is in the the depths. Our forces were beaten. There's a lot of them, isn't there? Oh yeah, these are these guys. Uh, I'm gonna watch this one. This is in the caves. I'm yeah, cave battle. Cool. These are my cool new spiders. Ooh, look at all those guys. Little frogs. And what are you, grubs? Frogs and cave grubs? They're animating the dead. Spiders fought valiantly, but not valiantly enough. fight than I was expecting. Yep. And there we go. Run away!
And then this one was... Oh yeah, us walking into Uruk lands. We killed all of them. No one died. Okay, so now we're one step away from this one. 80 units, lizard warriors, crocodiles. How bad can it be? Hey, Cormac, how you, how's it going? Lots of things around. Hey, there's some of these guys. Um, over here, we've got no one yet. Uh, here's where we're raising them. So we got, we got, oh, yes. Oh, there's only 20 units, some shamblers there. Can we take that one? We only made three of them. We'll make some more of these guys. Would you to go over there? We'll join up with, with all in here, and then we'll see if we can get someone to go take this out. Uh, I'd like you to, to recruit faster. Balthazar, can you do something like exciting, like make me a palisade? Yeah, there's a river there too, isn't there? Ah, yeah, that changes things. No, no, no. Sorry. Okay, we're gonna go for it. How are we looking here? We're looking fine. Lots of spiders. We're going in the trackless woods. I'm taking it. Where's that prophet of mine? I don't know where. I, I'm not sure who was the prophet. I forget. Was it you? You're the prophets. Um, so, you. Um, just you. I want you to go stand. Actually, here is probably a good spot because there's a lot of bad vibes. You know, that's what that bad, bad dominion. Actually, I'm going to go march you there and hang out over here. Uh, we'll build a temple or something. And then this guy, you're defending right now. Uh, work on that fort. Okay. Castle's the next one. Walk over there. Illithids. Okay, battle in, in Amurk. Some Urk people try to attack us. How dare they? Trackless Woods is the exciting one. Previously owned by independence, it's now conquered by us. Killed all them crocodiles. This is for the uh, the throne. One of the thrones. And each time you take one of these thrones, it gives you, like, you get perks. Boosts. We have some sort of a bonus to them. Whooped him. Victory. Okay, and then now I have to say. Oh, can anyone just, can anyone claim this place? I think that my... I want to do something. I think this guy has to be there. Doesn't he? Prophet. Does, a, does the prophet need to be there to do it? Oh, it's got more, that's got more exciting. Priest level three or a god. Okay. 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 Uh, can we bring in uh, someone to lead these troops? 
My my prophet is a level three, correct? Yes. So he can do it. Priest level three. So he can do it. Um, am I open to the idea of visiting older and old titles? Yeah, I play old stuff all the time. I love old stuff. Okay, what are you, are you recruiting? No, you're not. Okay. Um, depend, and you guys just hang out over there. Yeah, let's just focus on that, and then we'll we'll see if we can get these these things geared up. We go get this go get this spot, which they are kind of building up a bit of. Uh, we didn't see we did see a spot downstairs. There's one right there, but I have to I have to go into that square. I can't go anywhere else. Another opening there. Where was that? Where's that one at? To Ultima. Where's it at? There. And that leads us down over on that side. But there may be, that, that may not be anything open. Um, are you building over here? Building Palisade? Okay. I'm going to stay here and then I think on Tinti, you should be doing something more useful. We'll let you build things right now, though. Just defend that spot. Uruk attacked us again, but the god spider held them back. Xenthra. Uh, we defeated Uruk, attacking us again. Um, this is just uh, defenders. We didn't send very many of them. Ooh, it's hot outside. That's good for us. Well, maybe. Too many suns is, is not good for us. I don't think. Maybe it is okay for us. So yeah, heat four lowers income supplies, kills some population off. That ain't good. Okay, is that guy here? What's his name? You claim that throne. And that throne of pestilence is going to give us three death gems per turn, and we get death added to our dominion. Is it possible there's only 10 units there and we can actually take them out, you think? Is it worth trying to get them? Only 14 of me, so probably not a good idea. We'll get them. Hey, Clint, how's it going? Am I winning? Oh, I don't know. I don't have many of these. Of these. Uh, oh, it's six points to require. I gotta capture six of them? Never mind, I take it back. I'm not about to win. But I'll get myself an Ascension thing. That's winning in my book. That's really all I need. One one will do it. And I'll be happy. Uh, my Prophet really needs to do some spreading over here. He's clearly on the wrong side of the map. Because our, uh, our, our domain is starting to shrink a little bit. Okay, you grab that. I'm going to pass the turn again because I want to see this thing get claimed. Hooray! Claimed. Olm's oh, yelling at me about things. Uh, a battle. Uruk attacked me again. We've fought them back again. We do that a lot. Uh, Tifia. Military force has been, has been beaten by a stronger force from Uruk. Where's this at? Tifia? This is my just my defender force. Look at all the stuff they've got. Alright, alright. We killed a bunch of wolves at least. Uh, pestilence all over the place, and uh, a fort's been built. Is this here? Oh, how, do you, how do you get over there, you suppose? Oh, they're back.
I wish I could go over here. If I could find, we could like enchant, do some sort of enchanting. I wish I did get the 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 spell. Can I make? Oh yeah, that shield. I forgot about that shield. Did you get that somebody? Hey, um, you with the cool stuff. You pick yourself up a shield. What to do? Yeah. There you go. I forgot I made that. Who keeps attacking me? It's over here, Antha. That where they keep attacking me? Yeah. These guys. Okay. Time is it? Yeah, you know what? It's about bedtime. I would love to have these swim swimming men. Can I can I hire you here? No. I would love to have some swimming men. But no no. Hey, bad. How's it going? We've we've claimed one. I'm taking. I'm chalking that up as a as a little bit of a victory. Where's my victory um, screen here? I think that, I think that that's just that's it. We saw a little bit of the caves, not a whole bunch. It's a little bit of the caves. Man, I need that. Whoops! I didn't mean to hit that button. I came into this thinking, you know, I got dominions down. I, I got, I can refigure it out. Ooh, there's a lot going on here. It's slowly coming back to me about about the time we get to the end here. York keeps attacking me, and um, Zenthra, patrolling force, was beaten by the enemy. Still have our fortress. Where's this at? In Zenthra, under siege. In Zen, oh, there. How dare they? Luckily, I got folks over here. We can, we can. Not send at them. Ooh, look at all those things. And animals. Charge in there. And monkeys over here. What's over here? Look at all those monkeys. Itching to fight. Alright. I, I need to go to bed. So I'm going to call it a day here. Thanks for hanging out. This is Dominion 6. It's out uh, today. Uh, as of... Well, right, right now, if you're live with me, it's out, what, in an hour? It's out. And I'll leave Link all over the place, wherever they go. Thanks for bearing with me as I try to re-remember how to, how to play this game. And fail. <laughs> but I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Let's give me a few more hours or days of playing it. Alright, let's call it a day. Uh, you can, like, make your own maps as well. Um, where's the other stuff you can do? You can make your own god. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's all in there. Um, there's the map editor you can make. All kinds of stuff. But, anyway. Thanks for hanging out. There's Dominion 6. I will be here tomorrow. We'll play something else. And I hope you all have a good one.